I'm here, here with the winner, Derek Lewis. Derek, why'd you take your pants off? Yeah, my balls was hot. I understand. The only, the notorious Forecast. I'm Joseph, the host of the UFC Forecast. Got the co-host, Loaf. And we don't normally do this, but we got some updated locks and dogs of the week. Loaf's lock of the week. Uh, Jesus Aguilar. You can scratch that one out. He's $9 now on Betway Sportsbook. Loaf, tell them the reasoning behind that one. Yeah, I mean, that was ballsy as is. Um, I like Jesus Aguilar, but the more I thought about it is I don't want to lose a sixth streak in a row. I want to try to keep going. Don't want to lose all that. Don't want to risk it. So. And those six were on the thumbnail. Yeah, but I am, but I, like we will talk about it later too, I am switching Jesus Aguilar to my underdog of the week. I may yeah. as well still take him if I was that high confident in him. And I mean, he may as well be the underdog of the week. He's the biggest fucking underdog. That's crazy. So, Nine dollars. Really Nine dollars is, is high, man. I did not expect him to be that high. I I understand Tatsuo is really good and shit, man. But number one rated in Japan. But I mean Aguilar, I mean he looked good too, man. He, he did look he's good. fresh, like he looks good. So I mean, I he should, I definitely should be an underdog, but definitely not that high of one. Yeah. So who's your lock of the week now? Um, Who are you locking in your six in a row? It was on the thumbnail. Yes. We'll pull it up again here now. My lock of the week to make it seven in a row is going to be Hyun Sung Park seven and zero oh, against. Sung Juk Choi, 6-1. and one. I got Hyun Sung Park. Hyun Sung Park looks absolutely like a monster compared to Sung Wook Choi. Uh, seven, fi- seven wins. Uh, he's got six of them by finish. And he's pretty well rounded. He can get that submission or that KO. He's got four first round finishes as well. So I think he's a really good pick at $1.50. I like it there. So I'm going to go Hyun Sung Park for my lock of the week. And on the early picks, I was on the other guy. You were on Choi, Sung Wook Choi. Yeah, yeah. He's training with the Korean zombie and guys like that. That's why I thought he would get it done. But, like, the significant strikes averaging for your guy. High, definitely higher. A right lot here. higher, man. It's like over 10, isn't it? No, it's not that high. Definitely not that high. Oh, I thought it was near 10. Like your guy's is over 10. Oh, my, my lock of the week's over 10. Yeah. Oh. Well, mine's, like, I think mine's 6. six he's still seven. fucking high, man. Yeah, he likely gets it done. Going to be switching my picks on the final video. So, lowest lock of the week. Yeah, I agree with it. And I think on the over-under parlay that we have on the Friday show, we have Hung Sun Park and Sen Guk Choi over 1.5. It's 125 on Betway Sportsbook, so. But my lock of the week, it's staying the same. Rinya Nakamura, he gets this one done. 6-0, undefeated. Four knockouts, so I'm going to be looking for that on Betway. It's not out yet. And people must be really, like... There must be something must about this be guy high. that I have not seen or something because, I mean, this guy is a huge It's favorite. 175 to finish on Betway Sportsbook. And the guy he's fighting, Kazuma, he's going to be good on the ground, but he's not going to be much threat at the end of the day. Rinya Nakamura, he's going to be a good wrestler, and he's not going to get caught in anything. He's going to finish this fight. This one's going to go over, or under 2.5, sorry. Like, it's going to be he a looks finish. looks like a monster, too. It looks like a monster. Whenever the knockout prop comes on Betway, I'll be looking to play some money on that, Loaf. Yeah. My lock of the week. After Glover, you know, lost a lot of money on him. But and I definitely agree on Rinya, too. I'll be definitely taking Rinya. There's no way I'm taking uh, Kazuma. And your dog of the week? And my dog of the week, I'm going Jesus Aguilera. Or Jesus Aguilera. I'm not sure how you say it. It looks like Jesus. Um, but, yeah, $9, man. I mean, when I took him as my underdog, I mean, my lock of the week, I'm pretty sure he was $5. 5 50 yeah. Something like that, yeah. And then he jumped to 9 He has 6 out of, <laughs> six out of 8 wins by submission. His signature guillotine choke. He's got five guillotines. Yeah. So, I mean, he, Tatsuo better not find himself in a guillotine. Or I, I, my, uh, my money's on Jesus, man, because five guillotines, I mean, that's not a coincidence. He obviously practices that quite a bit. And, I mean, if Tatsuo makes a wrong move here against him, I feel like uh, Jesus will capitalize, and he should not be $9. Yeah, no, I mean, all pretty it, good. All it takes is one mistake, man, and you can't doubt the guy. I mean, people, he was 350 in his contender series, yeah. and he... Beat Buddy, like, just Eric a clinic. Pierre, just yeah. a clinic. Yeah, that was a clinic. So, I mean, I got to give it to uh, Jesus. Even, I know even people, underdog are, people are going to think I'm crazy, but I got to take Jesus, man. Yeah, a lot of people were commenting on the Instagram post they made because you locked in on them. I understand that. It's definitely a kind of a questionable, yeah, that, questionable that, ballsy pick, but I got to go. That was a ballsy pick, especially for your lock. That's, yeah, I had to rethink the lock. I was, <laughs> your former dog, Zayi, you're still... Zayi's definitely still, still winning. I'm going to put winning. that out there, but I just took uh, Jesus just because I had to take him on something if I took him as my lock originally. I had to take him as my actual dog, but, I mean, Zayi, you've got to... I'm telling you, put money on this guy. I think Z- I'm disagreeing with you on this one. 
and I'm st- I'm still disagreeing with you for the final. The guy's got 17 Friday. finishes, man. <laughs> yeah, but the other guy's good too, man. He I has mean, a lot of finishes. He very well, he very well could lose, but I mean, I, my my parlay, I'm gonna put some money on this weekend for sure. Is Jake Sergey dollar ninety five and Zayi three dollars? Well, don't, don't give all give away all the picks here. <laughs> Friday night we're gonna have the final picks, parlays, parfaits. We'll we'll save some parlays for that one. My dog of the week, Dennis Tullian. Um, that's staying the same. I still think he gets it done. I think he gets it done by knockout. I'll pull that up for you. This is the one that me and Ryan disagree on. I have Jung Young Park on this one. Oh, you have Jung Young Park on I that have Jung Young Park. Yeah. But you don't disagree with this one. This is my new dog of the week. I'm putting Derek Lewis there, dog of the week. He's my new dog of the week. He gets it done by knockout. Sprinkle some money on it. I'm s- 225. <laughs> Betway Sportsbook, he's getting it done. I'm not going to lie er, to you. 325 on Betway Sportsbook. He's a plus 225 on other betting fucking platforms, whatever. I'm still going to take him because his power is insane. He's got the most knockouts. Insane power, man. The no- most knockouts. One in- shot, it's over. Yeah, most knockouts in UFC history. I mean, if he catches one on Sergi, he's going to put him out. He caught one on Curtis Blades, Chris Dawkins. They were going in to wrestle and go for the takedown. So and he I caught them with the uppercut. I'm going to go Derek Lewis for KO, but I'm telling you. If, it's a good if, bet. It's if, 325. If, you can if, triple your money. If Sergi gets him to the ground. One though, shot. It's what I'm nervous about, man. Same with Alex Pereira. It was one shot. I know, but I'm just saying, yeah. if Sergi gets him he to the, the ground, power. that's what I'm worried Deadly about. Deadly power. He's got to get it on the feet. He's got to get it done fast. Or it's not, he's I'm, gonna, I'm not even worried about it. I know a lot of people are like, oh, Spivak's going to get it I'd to the ground. I'd be a bit worried about it. <laughs> no, I'm not worried, man. He has the power. He's He's been going for runs. He looks in shape. He's ready for UFC Vegas 68 at the Apex. He's 3-for-3 three three at the Apex. He's won them all by knockout. It's a good bet. You're going to triple your money on it. He's my dog of the week. Dennis Tullian's still a good dog, but he's not the dog of the week. I'm taking Derek Lewis KO, but I I won't be actually betting on it. But I'm picking Derek Lewis KO. (laughs) Okay, well, stay tuned for the Friday show. We're going to have all of our final picks out there. Parlays, parfaits. But those are the updated locks and dogs of the week. Stay tuned.